Hey, I'm Chef Super Dave. And I'm Sunny. We take food and wine and we pair it perfectly. Today we're going to make a classic clam dish and we're going to pair it with Sunbox 11 Winery 2007 Viognier, the nice. And it is going to be beautiful. So, this is what we're going to do today. We're going to take these little neck clams. I have 16 of them, 8 of them per person. I've got uh, one clove of garlic, chopped up fine. I've got one half of a large shallot, chopped up fine. Some parsley, a little bit of lime, some black pepper, some salt, a little bit of butter, some grapeseed oil, and the nice. Because nice. why? Because it's perfect. And because we always have to liquor up our food. Okay, so here we go. Oh we're no, we're... but see, we don't say it until you actually do it. Ah, uh, that's true. <laughs> He's like way ahead of the game I'm here. Right. I, th every, every time we do this, I get so confused. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to add about a half a teaspoon of grapeseed oil to the pan. And this pan has been on a medium heat right now, and the pan is good and hot. I'm going to turn the heat up just a little bit. So what do we need to see the oil doing when we know it's ready to go in? Basically, we're seeing, when you see the oil kind of thin out and ribbon. Okay. You can see that kind of ribboning effect in there. And you can also start to see a little bit of smoke coming off the top of the, uh, of the oil. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place the clams, uh, which have been washed, in, into the, um, the grapeseed oil. Very pretty. And you might want to step back and a little tiny bit for a second. You can hear that nice sizzle. I think they're very vocal clams. They're very vocal. Oh, that makes a nice instrument. Do that again. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to add a little bit of this garlic right now. That's like I said, one clove of garlic. Finely chopped. Half of a large shallot. You should have seen the shallot. It was large. You could probably use one regular shallot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's that? That was brutal wood, exactly. I finally figured out the meaning. And what we're going to do is, we're going to go ahead and add, we're going to have Sunny stand back and hand me the top. We're going to go ahead and add uh, the white wine. About a quarter cup. Nice shield. That was a pretty good shield. Maybe a little bit more than a quarter cup. And we're going to go ahead and Why? turn the heat up. So we gotta liquor up that food. Gotta liquor up that food. I think all the food we make, we have to liquor it up in some sort of way. So in the meantime, right now what's happening is the clams are actually starting to open up, and I'm gonna show you that. So one, two minutes, the clams all open up. Wow, they look so inviting, just all opened up. Ready for us to eat them. So the last thing we're going to do, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but the last thing we're going to do is we're going to add about one tablespoon of butter. And this dish is really quick. Mm. And I just also wanted to also it smells remind Smells delicious in here. I also wanted to remind you that when you do buy clams, you need to keep them alive. So you need to actually, when you put them in your fridge, you need to actually give them a little bit of air. So if they're in a plastic container, poke some holes in it. Yes. A little bit of parsley. That's looking beautiful. And it smells, oh my god, it smells wonderful. Can you smell that out there? Oh my god, it's so it's good. It actually has some really nice notes from the, from the honey in the, um, in the, in the nice. So I'm going to finish off with just a little bit of so uh, salt. Kosher salt. Very important. Chefs like to use kosher salt. And a little bit of cracked black pepper. And the reason why it's kosher salt, it's like, it's not... Salty, you know. It's, it's not as iodine yet, I think. Right. It's just very pure. You actually have to use a little bit more than usual. So we've got this really nice plate that is finished. And what I'm going to do at the last second here is I'm going to squeeze a little bit of fresh lime mm. to finish that off. And let this sauce reduce down for just about a minute so it gets a little bit thicker. It looks delicious. And I think we're ready to plate. So why don't you follow me on over here and we'll plate together. Wonderful. Okay, so now we're ready for our favorite part. Plating, toasting, tasting, eating, all of the above. Well, I think first thing we should do is probably get another good whiff of this nice, it's beautiful. Mmm. 
2007 Viognier from Russian River Valley, a very small vineyard, Katie's Corner Vineyard, a uh, beautiful coastal vineyard. Oh, what great fruit and what great wine. Why don't you tell them a little bit about the flavors in the nose? Uh, we have like really cool uh, honey comb in the nose. Uh, it's very prevalent, it's but yet not so sweet. The mid palate is wrapped up in peaches and cream, and the finish is like this soft vanilla. It's going to work really well with the fact that the sauce has some of the nice in it, as well as these delicate and sweet clams. Now, the nice will also match with some great spicy foods or some other uh, more delicate foods also, but the best match, I think, is fresh seafood. Do you agree? I think so. So uh, Maybe even a dessert, but, but definitely if you're okay. talking savory stuff, you know, seafood is the best thing that, you know, goes with the nice. And Sunny and I love to share our food, so we're going to be sharing a plate here. <laughs> He so I always, so. Th I always think so, but somehow I always. Uh, I might let him have one. <laughs> I might share another one with the cameraman, but you know. And that nice classic rustic sauce, which has all the garlic and the shallots and the parsley and the butter and the white wine, black pepper and salt. We're just gonna go ahead and cover those clams. Oh, yummy! Beautiful. So. I'm give that a little quick wipe down here. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. My favorite thing about eating food like this is no garnish, just dig right on in. All right. Eat me! Okay. <laughs> it's telling me to eat them. So. And can I take that for you? Mm. Thank you very much. And my turn. Oh my god, they're amazing. Oh my god. Together, absolutely amazing. Mm. Go for it. Clams are nice and clean and mm, that sauce. What do you think? I think it's something really special. What do you think? I think it's another perfect match. See you next time.